Uh, good morning. I'm with Cheryl Spear. And Cheryl. Oh, there's Roy. <laughs> and his beautiful 1958 Chevy Impala. Impala. That was the first year of the Impalas, wasn't it? That is correct. Come here. And, and look at what it's got under the hood here. Something pretty big. Tell us about it. This is original 348 with the original carburetor, tri-power carburetors. Uh, most of the tri-powers have been done away with over the past, either fuel injection or full barrels or whatever. But this particular one has still got the original carburetors that came from the factory with this car. Okay. How long have you had it? I've had it about 16, 17 years now. Oh, it's beautiful. Just beautiful. We're going to peek inside here. I always love when they, they inset that rear speaker on the Impala there. This is fine, fine transportation. Wow, wow, wow. All right, let's walk around here and got a, a Continental kit on the back. All right. Now, Chevrolet was trying to do something different in the 58. They, they wanted to go all out with the, with the 58 because that was the first year that the Impala was ever made. They tried, if you notice right above the back window there, it, it was, that was intended to be a vent where you could open your vent and the air would come through the car and exit out above the window there. But for some reason that didn't work out, so they just, they just made it an ornamental type of a, a design. Well, it looks very classy, doesn't it? And there's Linda. Hi, Linda. <laughs> wow, fantastic. Thank you very much for sharing this with us. Thank you.